they got to know what everybody's dietary intake was and tailored our meals to that dietary intake. Uh, that wasn't quite the end of it because there was another, did you have a question? No, no, good. Uh, there was another uh, 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 hypothesis floating around. It was a theory, everybody knew it was true, that when you went weightless, uh, since the large muscles of the body were not being used, it was a lot like being at bed rest. And if you're at bed rest, your basal metabolic rate goes down, your resting heart rate goes down, your caloric expenditure goes down, and you don't eat as much. And so Whedon took our average daily uh, caloric intake from the little seven-day test and subtracted 300 calories from it and then tailored everything to that. So instead of getting what we were getting, what we ate normally on the ground, we got what he thought we would normally eat in space based on this theory, which turned out to be totally false. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and, and it wasn't his fault. I believed the theory too. I thought, yeah, that, that's, that's probably about right. Turned out not to be true. 